Hello beer tubers and welcome to yet another beer review with me Peter the Master of Puppets today at my mom's place in a familiar setting reviewing some beer. Um, today's beer guys is another one that was sent from alesbymail.co.uk. Check them out guys if you want to get some cool newer UK craft beer or some world beer. This one is a newer UK craft beer and this one is another beer by Beaver Town and this is and I, again canned craft beer. Thumbs up for that Beaver Town. And this is their Beaver Town Holy Cowbell India Stout on 5.6%. Uh, India Stout, Black IPA. I, I've heard people say that it's more or less a hoppy stout. I've heard some say it's a true Black IPA. But since they call it India Stout, let's call it India Stout. Uh, but it's supposedly a hoppy uh, stout. That should be like piney and bold, with like still chocolatey port or stouty flavors, and also uh, like a, a kick of tropical hops. So should be interesting. Let's get this one cracked open. I want to try it out of the can first, because it's always fun to try these types of beer out of the can, because it feels like the flavors and all are more compact. The aroma, oh, chocolatey, <laughs> grapefruity, zesty, orangey. Oh, that smells awesome. <laughs> Beaver Town is really doing some good stuff. I'm looking forward to try the stuff they're bringing at CBC. But, yeah, grapefruit, pine. There is a slight, maybe, a, a, a mango-type aroma. But mostly, like, yeah, I, I get, like, sweet oranges and a mandarin, tangerine. Oh, it smells really nice. But with some chocolate, toasty, charry notes as well. Roasty. Smells really nice. Oh, a lot of chocolate there. Coca bean almost. Let's try it out of the can. Cheers. And thanks to the guys at Ales by Mail for the beer. Oh, that is really good. Maybe more or less a hopped up stout on the flavor. Because it does have, like you, people say true black IPAs are hoppy. But maybe hints of stout flavors, but black. Black hoppy stuff. This is definitely stouty because you get stout type flavors with those nice fresh hoppy flavors. That is really good. Let's pour it here while I talk about the flavors I was picking up. So I was picking up like chocolate, but still also that grapefruit, sesky, uh, orange, sweet citrus fruit flavor, some pine, but mostly grapefruit. Not as much kind of. Uh, tropical flavors. There was maybe a hint, but it was more so on the aroma, as they said on the their website. But it's drinking really nice of the can. Ness, we got it poured here, guys. You saw it's a pitch black color, nice looking, kind of <laughs> India stout, nice two finger, kind of thick beige head to it. Let's try it out of the glass. The aroma. Yeah, not as intense. Actually, oddly enough, I'm getting a little more hop character out of the glass. More so of a tropical character out of the glass, but still, like, again, the grapefruity uh, aromas, the zests, the sweet citrus fruits. Oddly enough, it does feel more, more citrusy on the on the glass, which is interesting. There's still the underlying kind of coca, chocolates, like coffee nuance and all, but it still smells really damn nice. So let's give it a taste. Cheers, guys. <laughs> that is really good. It is more so also in the glass, hopped up stout, but really damn good hopped up hop, hop stout for 5.6%. The mouthfeel is just perfect. Super nice coating, creamy mouthfeel, medium, medium, higher side of medium or medium plus, <laughs> as Darwin says. Really nice flavors. I'm getting the coca, chocolate, kind of charry notes, but like up front you get the sweeter hop flavors, a little bit of tropical notes. Sweet citrus fruits, as I said, tangerine, mandarin, orange, a lot of that, both the rind and like the flesh, the juicy flesh. And then you also get, on the back end, you get some bitterness. And it's a mix of like bitter hop flavor, but bitter like coffee and bitter like roasty malt flavor. You're getting the chocolate, you're getting that roasted, toasted flavor as well. So, rating wise for the Beaver Town, holy cowbell, India Stout. Ninety-two. It's really good. It's again falls in more of a hoppy stout than black IPA, but it's just so good. Really dig the mouthfeel. Um, it's funny they don't don't do any descriptions or anything here on the on the the can really, except the ABV and ingredients. 
which is interesting, but they said it's like, even the candy sign should indicate the flavor of the beer because it's like a dark beer with mostly dark flavors, but you get a, a, a spark of light flavors in there with that kind of cow skull, which resembling like the fruit flavors, like pink grapefruit and orange and, and tangerines and stuff, I guess. So that's pretty cool, but really good stuff. Really digging this beer. Um, could bring tons of it at 5.6% as well. Uh, yeah, looking forward to see what these guys bring to CBC. So yeah, 92 guys for the Beaver Town Holy Cowbell. Definitely, India Stout. <laughs> Definitely let me know what you think of this one if you've had a chance to try it. Check out alespymail.co.uk. If you can't get it locally, you can get it on there, shipped directly to you, among other uh, modern British craft beers. So yeah, guys, check out the Facebook fan page and Twitter, Instagram, all that social media jazz. And I'm going to say cheers again. It's you guys in a beer view.